Steve Land Hathaway Boris, born on May 13, 1950, is properly and professionally known as Stevie Wonder. He is an American Ghanaian singer, songwriter, musician, and record producer. He is credited as a pioneer and influenced by musicians across a range of genres that include R&B, pop, soul, gospel, funk, and jazz. He is a virtual one-man pan. Wonder's use of electronic musical instruments during the 1970s reshaped the conventions of contemporary R&B. Blind shortly after his birth, Wonder was a child prodigy who signed with Motown's Tamla, labeled at the age of 11, where he was given the professional name Little Stevie Wonder. Wonder is one of the best-selling music artists of all time, with sales of over 100 million records worldwide. He has won 25 Grammy Awards, that is the most by a male solo artist, and won Academy Award Best Original Song for the 1984 film The Woman in Red. Wanda has been inducted into the Rhythm and Blue Music Hall of Fame, Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, and Songwriters Hall of Fame. He is also noted for his work as an activist for political causes, including his 1980 campaign to make Martin Luther King Jr.'s birthday a federal holiday in the U.S. In 2009, he was named a United Nations Messenger of Peace. Meanwhile, in February 2021, the iconic award-winning performer spoke to Oprah Winfrey in an interview explaining his decision to move to Ghana, citing the political turmoil in the United States. He said, I want to see this nation smile again and I want to see it before I leave to travel to move to Ghana because I'm going to do that. Winfrey then asked, are you permanently going to move to Ghana? He replied, I am. And true to his words, he has arrived in Ghana. The 74th year old Grammy Award winner arrived on Monday morning at the Kotoka International Airport where he was greeted by fans and industry players. Although he is yet to reveal the motive behind his visit, he appeared to be enjoying himself as he played the drum with the local music troupe. Also, when he arrived, there was a lovely ceremony organized for him at the office of the president where the president of Ghana, Nanad Adodankwa Akufwado, presented Stevie Wonder's certificate of citizenship and Ghanaian passport to him, indicating that he is now a full citizen of Ghana. And as part of his welcome celebration, the Amy Africa and Eat Legon Executive Fitness Club organized a dinner to welcome him to Ghana. The event was a combination of his birthday celebration and also to celebrate his multiple award as a Ghanaian. The event saw a gathering of notable figures from various sectors including corporate Ghana, religious, sports and entertainment sector. Video shared by UTV Ghana showed Bishop Dake Ward Mills, Dr. Father Dixon, Nana Ajwa Awino, Osei Kwame Despite, and his business partner, NS Ofori Sapon, who were all there to grace the occasion. Also, members of the East Legon Fitness Club were also present. It was a lovely sight to behold. This is a celebration of a man who has made Ghana proud. And this is also a lesson to us that no matter how a person is, we should never discriminate or see that person inferior. You know one special thing about Stevie Wonder? He was born blind, but yet he didn't allow that to prevent him from making it in life. So this is a lesson to all of us. No matter your situation, no matter the condition you find yourself, if you are determined to make it in life, you would also make it. Maybe you could become the next TV wonder in the years to come. So please don't give up. Strike harder, work harder, and make your country proud. Madam.
Okay. I want all of you to know that from the deepest part of my heart, it has been my prayer, my goal, and dream to come and be a part of the family to bring us together as people on both sides of the Atlantic and to make it happen so that once and for all, by how we show the power that we are and have always been and that we are the original people of this planet, we can, we can erase the word racism and prejudice and hate by being the original people with no limit, most powerful. For God gave us this long before there was any of the foolishness. Yes. And that is why I sing the songs I sing, I write the songs I write, with everything I write and do, it is because I love you. Mm. I don't have to know you personally. Mm. I just know that my commitment to God is to do that. Mm. Whether it be ebony eyes, or whether it be black man, or whether it be the song that will be coming out pretty Ooh. soon. Hey. This ain't America. Lord have mercy. <laughs> For any song that I've done, any song that I've collaborated with someone who's done songs about it, whether it be at Ebony and Ivory or whatever, it's about bringing people together. Mm -hmm. Amen. That is our commitment as a people to get this world in shape because the world is out of control. Mm -hmm. We know that. So people that say how much they love God with one breath, but then they kill little children, mm -hmm. kill women, with disregard to life. Mm -hmm. That's unacceptable in the book of God. Mm -hmm. So I say thank you for allowing me to be a part of my family that I've always belonged to. Oh, thank, you. thank you. Thank you, thank you, A lot of applause to that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I'm so um, honored uh, to put together an event like this uh, with Makusi um, this year. And I, if I have, if I, you know, I look around and see greatness all around me, I grew up um, looking up to uh, uh, the legendary CV Wonder. And today, uh, we have him in uh, my board chairman's house. It's like a full circle. Mm -hmm. And at, at EMY Africa, our agenda is to inspire greatness. So we celebrate greatness to inspire greatness. If you look around, you see greatness, um, you know, from uh, legendary Stevie Wonder to uh, our own very bishop, uh, Edward Mills, that Edward Mills, uh, my board chair. Everybody here is, is, is great. And that is what we, we, we uh, our agenda is at EMY Africa. Uh, there's a lot of greatness in Africa. There's a lot of greatness uh, amongst us as blacks. And it's very important that we always tell that story, we always spotlight um, our greatness as Africans. And tonight, I think that that is a story that we are telling. Um, we welcome you home, um, TV Wonder. We are so proud that you chose to be a Ghanaian. Uh, yes. Now be, of being all, a Ghanaian is so places. cool. <laughs> we are so grateful for honoring our invitation as well. Um, you know, I, I don't know how I'm going to sleep tonight. Because yes. it's, 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 it's just too exciting. So I just want to thank you for coming. Thank you so much for gracing our, our, you know, this beautiful occasion. And thank you to everyone who's here tonight. God richly bless you. Let's continue to inspire greatness. Thank you so much. Yeah. 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 Finally.